Okay, how you doing? This week we're going to do a warm-up exercise, a technique, which is going to be alternate picking, and a lick. So, <clears throat> the warm-up exercise is, it's a kind of base off of like sweep picking, but it's, uh, it's not really musical as such because it's not using any particular chords or anything like that. It's just, it's kind of a, a purely a technical exercise. And um, the idea is you, you you play one finger per string and you pick four notes, four strings, sweeping down. So every, every string with a downstroke and then back up with an upstroke so that is essentially sweep picking so your, your right hand is going to be going okay so the left hand then is going now you can do this anywhere on the neck it doesn't matter you can pick whatever fret you want so I'm going to just start on the third fret here and um, we pick with our first finger on the D string our second finger on the G, fourth on the third on the B, and the fourth on the E. Okay. Then we reverse that. Put our first finger on the E, second on the B, third on the G, fourth on the D. So that gives us. Okay. Now, once we get there, we're gonna slide up a fret. And we're gonna with our little finger. Go fourth, third, second, first. So so far we have. We're gonna swap them around again. We're gonna reverse it. Little finger on the E, and then go back up the strings. So the whole lick, like uh, the whole exercise is okay. The idea with this is that you you can cycle it. And you just keep going around and around. Um, idea being, you're getting your picking and your fingering locked in together, uh, and you're you're work you're kind of working on the independence of your four fingers. Okay. Um, there's another version of this then, which is it just descends up the neck, uh, or as ascends up the neck. Um, the idea is very similar. You start the same way, then you come back down the same way. But then instead of sliding your first your baby finger up, you you put your first finger on the next fret up. So. And then you just ascend up the neck. Okay. Now the others you could do another. You could go. Um, that kind of thing. Or you could go. loads of different versions of this you can do you know the, the idea is just that you're getting your four fingers and you're you're picking locked in together okay so that's the that's the warm-up do it slow and make sure it's clean and that every note is as loud as the next and that the your tempo is even okay so then the next thing we'll do is um, a little alternate picking practice lick um, and it's very very simple. It's just three notes on one string and one note on the next string. So we pick the D string. We pick uh, down on the fourth, up on the fifth fret, down on the seventh, up on the fourth fret, down on the seventh, up on the fifth, down on the fourth again. Um, that we're back to the start. So. That's the thing, you just build up speed. 
start slow make sure it's even and tempo is 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 even um, and then you can change the the positions or, or use a, f a different fragment of a scale uh, like that's that's kind of like um, like an F sharp uh, I suppose that would be a Locrian scale I but you could go um, different strings you could make um, make a, a larger lick out of it by maybe taking a G major scale so go you know that kind of thing um, but it's just it's just a matter of locking your your two hands in together but your picking is really even and solid. Um, and that's that's good for working on, uh, you know, improving your your speed because it's it's such a repetitive robotic kind of thing. But you, because it's it's again it's just a, it's only a fragment of a scale. You can move it around and apply it to anywhere. Okay, so. Using, taking on from that then, the, the lick we're going to do is a, an alternate picking lick. It's all down, up, down, up. There's no there's no weird string skipping or funny picking. And um, it's actually a very simple lick, but it's just that it's played fast, so then it's, it kind of sounds impressive. So um, the lick goes like this on some overdrive. So I'm starting on the 14th fret of the E string, and the lick goes like this. Oh, sorry. Okay. And the idea is you're picking three notes per string, then down to the next string, and you repeat that string and repeat it down. So and then bend up a note. Um you can kind of think of this like this one, the, the, that that pattern, that fingering would really be coming out of uh, the G major scale, starting on the seventh degree of it, which would make it the Locrian mode. Again, we'll get into the theory another time, but um, you could you could play this lick over E minor like a. The, the note you finish on really is going to give you kind of more the. Um, the tonality, so. Okay, and the, the good thing about this lick is you can, again, it, because it's a pattern, it's just a, it's just a repeating pattern, you can apply it to any scale. You could play it over a, a major scale, so if we played it over A, it would be. That'd be A major. We could do it over. Let's pick a um, B Dorian. Okay, so again, that's the idea. The, the, it's actually very simple. It's just that it's played fast. Your picking needs to be clean, and um, and that's it. So again, the pattern is three notes per string. Then the next string. Repeat that. Okay, so that's it. Right, we'll see you next time.